Hello, if you're watching this right now, you're probably struggling. You're probably an IB student struggling about the concept of il price elasticity of demand. Let me tell you a bit about myself. I used to be an IB economics student as well, and I'm, I got level 7 for my IB economics higher level. Okay, so I want, what I want to do here today for you is to give you some basic knowledge about PED, and I will tell you exactly how the IB like to test you on PED. Okay, so if you want to do well on your test for PED, um, pay attention, okay? So before we talk about PED, you need to first know about the very basic demand curve, right? Demand curve is downward sloping, which means that as the price of a good goes down, the quantity demanded of a good is going to rise, right? You should have learned that at school. Okay, so the PED is actually the percentage change in QD over percentage change in price. So one way you can interpret it, for example, what does kilometers per hour mean? Kilometers over hour. Kilometers over hour is basically how many kilometers in an hour, right? Kilometers per hour tells you how many kilometers you travel in one hour, okay? So PED is basically how, for every percent change in price, how many percentage change in quantity demand do you get? So for example, EG, if PED equals to 2, it means that the price increase 1%, QD decreases by 2%, okay? So that is the whole idea. Okay, so the PED measures the responsiveness of PED of quantity demand change in price. So when price change, how much does the quantity demand change? The higher the PED, the more responsive. So for one percent change in price, you get a bigger percentage change in QD. Okay, so real life application, for example, like when producers they're thinking about whether they should raise price or lower price to maximize their total revenue, they need to look at the PED. Okay, because they, for example, if they raise price, they want to see how many customers am I going to lose. Okay. So how is the IB going to test you? What are some important things? So the number one thing that is important, you need to know for IB, is the relationship between price and total revenue. PED explains the relationship between price and total revenue. Secondly, are the determinants of PED. Okay, very common. The determinants of PED. So what determines whether PED is high? What determines whether PED is low? Okay, determinants of PED. Third thing you need to know is our calculations. So you need to know make calculations relating to PED in your paper three. Okay. So um, if you want to if you want to go through, so what are some common exam questions? Common exam questions. Okay. One common exam question is explain how uh, firms can use PED to maximize total revenue. Okay. Another exam question possibly is explain why manufactured goods have a higher PED than agricultural goods. Okay. And then calculation. Well, there are a range of things they can ask you to calculate. Well, this is it for today. But if you want to, actually, we, we have an online tutoring platform for overseas student, students outside of Hong Kong. Okay, If you're a student outside of Hong Kong, you can go down the link below to register a free trial lesson Okay, on our online platform. No commitment needed, no down payment at all. Just uh, fill in the form below, and then you can open an account in our online platform, and then we will send you the notes we have on price elasticity of demand. And in the lesson, what I'll do is I'll teach you go in great detail about the concept of PED. Not only that, I would tell you how to an I'll teach you how to answer all possible IB exam type questions. Okay, so I'll teach I'll give you an outline for every question in great detail how you can tackle these exam questions. What are some exam phrasing you should use? Okay, what are some diagrams you should know how to draw? Okay, if you're if you're a student based in Hong Kong, you can click the bottom link for HK student and then register a free trial at our, at our center. I'll, so our team would give you notes, exam-oriented notes, um, IB mock exam questions. So we'll teach you exactly how to deal with these exam questions. What you need to know.